Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woki, and I'm back with some Drew really no Lost. Um, free on my the night is mine. By the time I release this, I think later on tonight it's going to be New Banner, so that means New Banner means more this summons. Hooray! So I wanted to look at the units real quick, and then once I'm done looking at them, I'm going to, um... Uh, I'm going to finish off doing the night... Whatever, we'll get into it. This one's called the New Year's Tiding, a Clawful Caper. The new adventure is Mitsuhide. Uh, leading a worm clan is Yon, sleepy business. Uh, her skills are Mouse Revenge, deals light damage to a target in nearby, and I just like the idea of something being called Mouse's Revenge. Deals uh, light damage to the target in nearby enemies and inflicts paralysis. And then Calamity Drop is deals light damage to the target in nearby enemies, increases the user's attack rate by 10% for 10 seconds, and deals an additional damage relative to the combo count when the skill is used. The maximum bonus damage is given when 30 hits or higher. And co-op ability is critical rate 10%. She has Flurry Strength, which is increases strength by 20% when a combo count is 15% or higher. Curse Resistance 100%, and she has Paralyzed Punisher. Uh, all right. And then also the light unit. Someone, I can't remember who was in the in my in my in the Trash Alliance Discord, assumed that this was going to be the Skill Dragon for light. It's not. Uh, this dude's name is Daikokuden. Daikokuden. Sure, let's go with that. Lucky Mallet deals light damage to enemies directly ahead and creates a buff zone that lasts for 10 seconds and increases the attack rate of adventures inside it. Not bad. And then Light Strength 55% and then Worldward Strength 25% but only when the combo count is 15%. Not 15%, 5, 15 or higher. So they're kind of made to work together. Alright, pretty interesting. Uh, the one thing I'll know about uh, Mitsude is that she does not actually... No, she does. She does inflict in Paralysis. Oh, that's great. Having Paralysis Punisher and then also inflicting Paralysis is really good. And I... Let me see, actually. I can't remember... I haven't done the, um, the Void, so I'm not 100% sure if that one is Curse Resistance or if they could be Paralyzed. But I remember someone telling me, might have been Lerp telling me that Paralyze um, is used a whole bunch in... Um, uh, is used a whole bunch in what in the harder events, so I'll go with that. I'm I'm slowly making my way through it. So, and then we have Nobunaga, Nobu 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 Nobu, of the Horse Clan. Uh, Dream Offensive deals the flame damage to the enemies in a line and applies Burning Ambition to enemies. Enemies will take flame damage when Burning Ambition's effect ends. Burning Ambition does not stack and cannot be reapplied to enemies still affected by it. So wait, that means she deals double flame damage basically. Unless, I don't know, Fla Flash Unity deals flash damage to enemies directly ahead and dispels one buff from each target. Hmm. I think, is that the first, is she the first to do that? It'd be interesting to hear if she is. Tell me if she isn't. Um, her co-op ability is Strength 10%. She has Flurry Strength, Sleep Resistance, and World's Dream 2. Ah, uh, Sleep Resistance. That's a shame. I was about to say, actually, that's not the biggest shame in the world because current, um... HM, HMS has, no, is it HMS or HMC? It's not Mercury, it's high middle card. Let me quickly pull it up so people know what I'm talking about. Um, this one, H, yeah, hey middle, why does he have such a hard ass name to say? HMS, uh, HMC is high Mercury tri trial. Anyway, I can't fight properly everyone, with this dumb because staff. of, Wish I knew how to use a sword. Can you stop talking? Thank you, sir. Um, everyone with sleep resistance. All the best units currently being used have sleep resistance and not stun resistance. So maybe it doesn't matter as much as long as she can bring the damage. So interested to see how they are. I'm definitely going to be pulling crazy. Um, hopefully I get them. The last New Year's unit, Iyasu, was insanely good for when he was released. Also, by the way... He's still insanely good. He's getting his six mana circle, so um, that's nuts. I can't, I can't wait to actually try him out when he gets it. But uh, just the idea that they decided that Iyasu needed one is kind of crazy to me. I mean, he does. It's not his fault. Galicleo is extremely powerful, <laughs> but that doesn't mean you should buff the second one of the most powerful units of the game just because he's not as good as the most broken card in the entire game. But whatever. I digress. I'm very interested in these units. There's also oh, Slumber Shots coming back. I have to remember to make a video of that. There's a Platinum Summon too, which guarantees you either Nobunaga or Daikuden. I think that's the way it goes. 
at some of the five adventures in Five Dragons I'll go. Hmm. It just said some. I don't know. If it's only the limited units, I would pull for it. If it's not, that's kind of a deal breaker. Um, I have too many units as it is. <sighs> so anyway, yeah. With that, I will now do the final thing of New Year's Tidings. I will fight Shimishama? Shimoshama? Shishami? This big old dragon one last time on Ultra Hard Aid difficulty. It's been um, real easy because this is the third time. This is the third rodeo I've been on with this man. Yeah, what the hell? Why didn't... Never mind. This new feature, by the way, fantastic. Should have had it a long time ago. Glad it's here. But yeah. Damn, this I, it's dubstep remix in the background. Oh yeah, so I'm gonna beat this day, dudes. But I'm gonna beat that butt good. Assuming we can find the room. And this is, I think, probably the last I time we'll use see my him. Strength to create peace. Okay, Yasu, chill. Come on, let's do it. Are you seriously not good? We have over twice. No, that's not over twice. Over twice would be 180. Are you fucking kidding me? Or was I not good enough? You're gonna give me a complex here, bro. Come on. We should not have trouble. I guess we were too powerful. Um, because that's definitely been something that's been tough, is actually I killing. I will use my strength to create peace. Yeah. It's a sick remix. I'm afraid of jostling the, uh, extension cable too hard and accidentally, um, losing sync with the game, but it's fine. It's all good. I'm no pushover, you know. I'm no pushover. Or so. go, go, go. I don't know how many people know this, but if you ever played uh, the Dark Souls DLC, do you remember that item that you get, I think, from the Rock Giant? That when you threw it, it made a sound because there's no, there was no like sound in it. That's what this dragon sounds like. I'm sorry. All right, this guy's dead. Come on, the gift gasket. The gift gasket? The gift gasket. Gift basket first. Alright. This guy's good. Get out of our face. I'm down. I'm done for. I'm done for. Thud. Oh, does he actually say thud? <laughs> That's funny, I never noticed. A most satisfactory conclusion. I mean, we completely overpowered this man. He was dead as doorknob. All right, thank you very much. Uh, it's fine. It's not the best, not the worst. That's how I feel about it. Okay, let me see. Do I have one of these? I do. I'll play it one more time. Just to say, like, I'm very interested in the banner. I'm going to be pulling just because... I don't think there's anything coming up that I'd like super Valentine's Day is the one. I Oops. will use my strength. Uh there's gotta be a gala banner coming up eventually. Um I think that should come in the start of the month, maybe? A little bit after the start of the month. It's been maybe close uh, to one no month. So you know. I'm saving my tickets for that. I like to save round my tickets for the gala banner. Um go, go, go. Go, go, go! Oh, I'm dead. Oh, sorry. Done. Yeah, he, <laughs> he totally says thud. I never noticed. Satisfactory <laughs> conclusion. Oh, I love you so much, Dragalia. That's such a dumb thing to put in. <laughs> What does he say? Fun. <laughs> 14 seconds, by the way. I'm almost positive we could do it faster, but it's fine. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be summoning for him. I think I'm not sure if I'm gonna go hardcore yet, just because I feel like with the current buffs. Oh yeah, I'm at a freaking stamina. Sure. Um, with the current buffs, old characters are getting. I'm not 100% sure if I should be summoning for new dudes. <laughs> I actually think it's better to currently hone what you have in order to build up the old ones because I didn't really talk about them that much, but it turned out like everyone that kind of got buffed is insanely good now. 
Um, especially, like, the only reason that they don't get more shine on is because so many things... Uh, the main dragon you fight all the time is stun resistant. Um, so that's why you don't hear much about him. But the second, like, someone like Hypnos comes back who is sleep resistance, like, they're gonna, you're going to see him all over the place, which I think is cool. I like that they set out to make the meta a little bit more diverse. And it's funny to think about a di diversity in, like, a co-op meta, but yeah, it totally does exist, you know? As funny as it is to see um, four Galicleos completely destroy a, an event, that doesn't mean that has to be the only thing. <laughs> That's the kind of the thing I think they want to strike a balance with. So hopefully with Yasu's buff, maybe one Yasu is going to be good as opposed to... I think the current setup is either four Galicleos or three Galicleos and an Audric. And if all of those are limited, so if you don't have any of those dudes, you can't do Masters um, High Jupiter at all. Crazy. So with that, I hope you liked the video. If you did, leave a like. If you have any um, feelings about how the units are going to turn out, tell me. I'll gladly listen. I'll, I'll, I'll ruminate it, and I'll see you guys next time for the summon video for Dragalia. I'm, I can guarantee you that. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.